What's up guys, ComputerMD of Gilbert here, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to add Dropbox to your Wix website. Dropbox is a pretty nice tool because it allows your visitors to upload documents or pictures or videos to you, to submit to you. Um, and this is nice, especially if you're like trying to collect resumes or trying to collect input from somebody. So definitely use this tool if you have anything of the source or uh, anything of the sorts. Uh, once again, guys, wixmywebsite.com, link in the description below. If you guys have not signed up yet, you have to get on this email list. I can tell you sooner rather than later, this email list will know about the course going live, um, and you guys are going to want to be on it. The first 10 people to enroll in the course when it goes live will get a very valuable gift, and you will not want to miss it. Once again, I'm here to help you teach you and help you learn how to build a website from scratch to finish here in Wix and not only that but just give you a new understanding and a new overall knowledge of Wix and how to use it. Other than that guys go check that out link in the description below but let's show you how to add Dropbox to your Wix website. So you're simply going to go to the app market and then I already typed it in but you type in Dropbox up in the search and then you'll see right here, get files to Dropbox. Allow your users to upload files directly to your Dropbox account. You'll click add to site. Once you do that, you'll see this pop up. It's a good looking design. And you simply double click it to activate it. Once you do that, you can see main right here. Let your site visitors upload files to your Dropbox account. So if you do not have an account yet in Dropbox, you need to press connect account or create account sorry um, but if you do have a Dropbox account already and you're ready to accept files you'd press connect account once you do that it'll link your Dropbox account to this app next you'll see folders so you have to obviously connect your account and then when you get into there I'll show you in a second but we're gonna go into settings first so right here you could choose your upload limit so upload limits show like how how much one visitor is allowed to upload uh, and you could simply once you connect your account you could set that limit so the file size the upload limit so every upload it says requires an email a password or nothing so in this case it says an email you could choose a password and you would then set the password or nothing so anybody could upload whatever files um, and you're leaving it open but if they do need an email you just simply click that Next, you'll see additional settings, so new subfolder per upload, email me for every upload, and users can add a message. Um, these things are pretty self-explanatory. Uh, email me for every upload, users can add a message right here. So every time an upload happens, you'll get an email, and users can add a message. Subfolders are just like, obviously, subfolders to this. Next is your layout. So you can choose whether it's a button or it's a full upload design um, which actually leads us into our last uh, one of our last categories which is design so in the design just like all the other Wix apps you can fully customize the look the font the colors the feel everything about it customize it to your site's needs um, and yeah make it your own and then you have text right here so right here you can see title that's where file upload would be upload limit label so right here up to 10 megabytes email label obviously and message label simple as that you change those customize them to your needs now right here in folders um, this is where like you would have different folders that people could drop files into and you would simply create these folders again you have to connect your account to do so um, so once you connect your account it's pretty self-explanatory easy to do uh, and I'm sorry I don't have my account connected right now, um, but I'm not going to be using it here on this website. But it's simple to do once you connect your account. Um, and then main is this, just this has pretty much a main screen, shows your account, shows the files dropped in, um, so all of that. If this video helped you guys out, which I know some of you had a question about it, uh, please leave a like down below. That would be awesome. Comment if you have any questions at all regarding this video or anything Wix. I'm here to help you guys out. And don't forget to subscribe to me here on Computer MD of Gilbert as I am looking forward to growing with you guys. And part of that growth comes from this WixMyWebsite.com, WixMyWebsite course. I'm here to help you guys grow, not only grow your website, 
grow your knowledge on Wix, but just grow all together and learning everything about Wix and the editor and the dashboard, your knowledge about Wix so you can talk to other people about it, understand what Wix is and what it does and how it helps people. So if you guys are interested in that, wixmywebsite.com, link in the description below, and sign up to get on this email list so that way you're notified first when this course goes live. And like I said, first 10 people to enroll in the course will get something very valuable uh, and you will not want to miss that. Thank you guys for spending a couple minutes with me and I'll catch you on the next one.